The same people that are telling you that you can't have a right to say who you will vote for, those people will be soon to take Jesus out the school. Those people will be soon to remove Jesus, period, from America, which is the Bible belt. Those people will be soon, man, come on, man, I ain't finna go Alex Jones level on y'all, man, come on, man, what y'all want? Like, wake up, wake up, Mr. West, wake up, culture. Wake up. Everybody think they so woke, but they following the rules of what woke's supposed to be. Hip-hop ain't never been about following rules. It's been about doing what you feel. I'm going to take the Louis. I'm going to throw it like this. I'm going to do it with the polo. I'm going to do it like this. Even like the way I talk. Hold on. Let me use my African-American voice. Let me use my Disney-approved voice. Let me use, You know what I'm saying? We're not even speaking in our own language, bro. Like, we talk louder than this. Africans talk loud. Italian moms talk loud. We talk louder, but we speak in our corporate voice. Or we don't want to ruin the deal voice. Or this why, bro, I love y'all, man. And I love me. And I love Christ. And y'all should love to see this. I'm not mad, I'm not gonna tell y'all what y'all should do. I'm just doing what I do. If you love it, then cool. If y'all wanna rap me, it ain't gonna make a difference, honestly. I done been killed so many times on social media and i'm still here i'm still talking look at me do yes. you do you care i told you i care I'm talking about, about everything how you pre okay perceived <laughs> which which could be a crazy word perceived as far as like how how people look at you do you care about that i need people to just i don't even need anything i'm praying that people can see that Jesus won the victory. When I was making raps in, in service to the devil, talking about you a hoe, I love it, all this, I was in debt. Now that I'm in service to Christ, God is showing off. He's showing off in my life. He's showing off in my family. Everything we do is for the church so we can heal, so we can go on missions, bring food, bring in. We was down in the Bahamas with Rick Fox working on hurricane-proof mm -hmm. hurricane homes. Soon as somebody, we figure out collectively how to fix that, that works for Haiti. That works for the Dominican Republic. That works for uh, third world countries around the world. The amount of energy and engineers that went into turning the iPhone camera from t one camera to two, and guess what we got here? We got three cameras on you that take super long to take a photo if anybody got the new iPhone. <laughs> but, uh, the, uh, <laughs> the amount of information and thought that went into that can fix the Bahamas, can fix Haiti. So many people at MIT, let me tell you MIT right now, y'all in a box. They have you in a box, you can save the world. But you are working on things that are too small. Take a step back. Stop worrying about, stop worrying about your college, uh, your loans. Stop worrying about what job that they got waiting for you in Silicon Valley. MIT, you can save the world. Kids in college, you can save the world. I'll put my life on this interview right now. It's up to y'all. Y'all have the ability to just step back, step back from what you think culture is today. It's not, it's not about any candidate. It's not about red or blue. It's about humanity. Y'all talking about it's 12 years of oxygen left. Talking about we're going to kill the earth. We can't kill the earth. We're going to kill the things that keep us alive on the earth, and the earth going to survive. It's up to y'all. Y'all the future. Y'all the future. But what y'all working on right now? I'm working on, I'm working on this 3D printed thing that is funded by, funded by who though? Y'all could do it.